Okay, Arjun, good work today thus far. We'll do a little bit more out on the range. Here is your first swing, and I use two words to kind of just cue you and get you going with the, uh, the explanation. This is a little bit open and a little bit flat. As we continue on up to the top of the backswing, you can see what starts as open and flat kind of continues as open and flat. And then as we get on up here, although you get a little bit longer in the backswing, which is fine at the moment, we are open in this area here. So what happens once you get that open and flat thing going, you have to put a lot of hand into it, because it comes in here open and flat too, a lot of hands into it to try and square up the face. And then the exit, you can see it kind of gets rolly and low like this. And another way I explained that was at the end of your swing, clearly here the end of your swing, the toe of the club really wins the race all the way through your swing here. So the toe wins the race in your swing. So what we were looking for was to, to try and improve those, those things by really getting into the first move in your golf swing, your takeaway. So I showed you a couple of examples of different, uh, different takeaways. I've always you know, admired the fact that Rory McIlroy works hard on his takeaway, and certainly when he's here, it's a theme in his practice. And in this little sequence here, he does a really good job of getting the club away to a good start. So it doesn't matter whether you're 12 like you are, or whether you're 26 like he is, trying to get the club off to the right type of start is something that we always want to do. So we're going to put your old move back up next door to the new one. And after some practice, you were able to have the club moving away less open and flat and a little bit more square and in front of you. Now, I'd still like you to practice that nice and low, slow motion swings. But once it got square and in front of you, you didn't have to put half as much hand action into it to be able to hit the golf ball. And we could see that because the exit of your club we call the exit when it goes past your body like that. The exit of your club was very different. And this one over here on the right, the toe of the club is really winning the race. Whereas on this one, the club face is working a little bit more as one entity rather than the toe really going for it. So when we look at it from the other side, what we noticed was that the toe of the club over here was really winning the race to the follow through. Whereas because your hands didn't have to get just as active here, the toe of the club wasn't just as evident as a big clear winner. It was coming through in a little bit of a better, a better fashion. So a really, really good way for you to start to see how a, a, an improvement in your takeaway helped you to control the club down through the impact area. And that's going to be something we're going to continue to work on and certainly something the best players in the world work on throughout their entire careers. Keep up the good work.